Alrighty, here we go. We're gonna go with the cream. Let's see how this goes. Just, uh, setting things up a little bit. Okay, okay, here we go. Alright, new game. Yeah, that one. Okay, alright, here we go. Three, two, one, go. And hopefully that timer, a <laughs> number I set to is basically right. I'm pretty sure it's really close. Okay, rolling. Oh, it's been peaceful. <clears throat> Should be right here, but we'll see. One and yeah, that's right. That looks very close to right, so cool. Thank you for releasing me, Spyro. Free ten dragons Ooh. in the artisan world. Then find Just realized this is uh to the next world. What about nasty Newark? I Spyro. One twenty percent, not Spyro. Any percent. Forgot to change my stream title. Yeah. So I have, uh, I've played this game about a billion times in my life. Um. But, I have not, there we go, I have not done any timed 120% attempts, so it will be interesting to see how this goes, because I know where everything is, I just haven't actually thought about routing at all. There's a few here, and then one here, and a few here. Nope, damn it. Anyway, and as for an estimate, I'm really just hoping for like sub three hours, I think would be a decent goal for now. work out. That's what he says. Okay. Thought there was a guy there. Oh. That guy moves. To a place that I didn't expect him to move to. There we go. My ruin then? Am I going to fall before the the mighty level Dark Hollow? I mean I've mostly been doing any percent runs, so I'm not as familiar with any kind of routing for this level. I believe I just did everything. Is that it? Yeah, I'm good. Level one, done. Okay, now I need to get the rest of the gems in here. Oops. Sure, I'll grab that life, why not? I guess I'll do the flight next. 
Oop. Great. Great spiraling. Okay. Let's try this again. There we go. <clears throat> Let's see. What is a good way to do this level? I believe it's planes. I'm sorry. Trains, planes, arches, and chests is the best way to do it. But Sunny Flight is another one. It's been a long time since I've thought about this level. Okay, I guess I'll just hang out for a second and wait for the other train to come by. Oop. There's that other train. Damn it. Damn it. <laughs> oh, I never do this one. Oh, hey, Dunbear. Well, thank you for... for the Pog Champ. I don't know that it's really warranted yet. Um, all I've done is uh, Dark Hollow poorly and Sunny Flight poorly. Oh yeah, you get to, you get to see my chill stream. It is quite chill. It's past midnight here, so I am kinda tired. And I'm playing a game that I've played about a million times. Wah. Yeah, I think I'll be fine. Should be good on time. Ugh. Very good on time. Well, I'm glad I didn't lose on Sunny Flight. I haven't done that level in a really long time. <laughs> Hello, H-Back. I'm also glad I got the, uh, hitting the crystal at the end there to end early, because that's hard to do unintentionally. <clears throat> or, like, it's hard to do if you're not planning for it. Okay, real quick, are there any gems up here? Because I don't remember. No, there are not, but there are some at the bottom of this. I'll grab those. Grab those, and then get these fellas, or one of them at least. No, get out of here. Get these here, and then I'll do Stone Hill. That sounds good. You've... Yeah, Dis uh, Dunbar's in the Discord. Okay, now, I believe... Oh, that's not what I meant to do. I wanted to get all of those first, and then go this way. Oh, fart, come on. No. Let's see if I can remember some kind of a route for this. I'll be impressed if I can, to be honest. Gonna... Come on, Spyro. Oh my god, buddy. Buddy, why? This one here, then the two that are over here, and I'll get that thief. Or at least I'll try to get that thief, and hopefully I'll get him pretty quick. Yeah, I got fast, damn. And there's the one back here. And then I'll hop it down. Get that, buddy. All these. Okay, actually hit that guy. Oop. Oh, fuck. I have been really bad about getting those... those shepherds. Oh, Hollaback Gaming, yeah.
Okay, then I go over here. And glide down for the key. And I get that gem, I don't skip it. Come on, Sparks. Now, one thing I did not think about is I s did not get a couple of the gems that are on top of the castle. So I guess I'll get these gems real quick and then go back out and get those on top. Oh, what? Oh man. It's been a long time since I failed that. That's not a hard jump. Even when you do it that poorly, you still make it. Okay, I got the ones that are over here, right? No, I did not. Glad I checked. Oh shit, did I get all of those? No, I didn't. Ah, oh, close! Okay. So yeah, for you guys tuning in who are not familiar with me, I, uh, I've played this game a million times and I've watched a bunch of speedruns, but this is my first actual 120 attempt. And I'm missing three gems. Where did I forget gems? I probably should have looked in the well first, but whatever. Oh, I thought I got everything up top. Gonna check the well again real quick since it is right here. Oh. Man, oh, I know what it was. I forgot to get the three that are in here. Doop, doop, doop. There we go. Hey, hey. Wow, I'm really glad I did not bonk. Ah, I'm glad I did not bonk on that platform. That was close. Hello, Tomas. Goodbye, Tomas. Hello, Treasure Nork. Oh my god, what was that? Those blind glides. Let me try that again. Let me try that again and get the camera lined up. There we go. What? Spyro. Spyro, please. Okay. Okay. No more trying to be cool and fast. I'll just... I'll do it the right way. Man, I hate that camera does not want you to see anything. There's a gem there. Isn't there? Yes. Two gems, in fact. Aha. I remembered. Take that, all the chickens. <laughs> yeah, the camera and sparks definitely are problems. Okay. Okay, let's see if I can... Hey, first try! Best dragon, I'm gonna let it play. Thor! Thank you for releasing me. Love that dragon. Best one. Right up there with Conan, who is also a thank you for releasing me dragon. Okay, got that. Oh, 
more gems there than I realized. No, oh, wait, that's not what I want. Not going up there quite yet. Also, I have no idea if the route I'm taking is the fastest route here. I'm just doing the any percent route and then also getting the rest of the stuff in the level. I don't know why. And then I can hop down here. Come on, Spyro. Be a dragon. Spyro, why are you like this? Okay, so that's that one. By the way guys, sorry if I'm not interacting with chat too much. I am trying to focus. Oh my god, I didn't think I would get that either, but first try, holy crap. Yeah, got toasty. Heck yeah. Now for one of my favorite songs in the game. Ooh, that was close. Oh, you'll only be here for an hour oh, three in the morning there. Yeah, it's almost one in the morning here. And this run, I am thinking, is going to be probably a little more than three hours long. So I totally understand if you can't stay forever. I'll just have to make it entertaining enough that you'll come back in the future. Man, you can get those dogs even when they are right on top of you. I remember having so much trouble with them before, but they're really not that bad. Here's where the song is great. Getting distracted by the good music and taking damage. Great. Where did he go? There he went. Perfect! Except for that one hit I took, that was uh, pretty good toasty, I think. Okay, so now I need to get the dragon that's out here. I'll grab a butterfly and these gems. Gotta get those two norks on the hill, those gems on that ledge, and then I should be able to just run to the balloonist. Get out of here, nork. Hey, no. No, you don't get to go back there. Nuh-uh. Not really what I wanted. Whatever. It worked out. Ninety-eight, ninety-nine, one hundred. Perfect. 
Uh, and I want to make my split now, when I make the selection. That is when I split. 20 minutes on artisans, okay. I have no concept if that is good or bad. That felt all right, though. I'm happy with that. on the spot. Hey, I would be happy with that. My eventual goal, well, I mean, my eventual goal is, you know, world record because I like this game and want to keep playing it, but for now, my reasonable goal is uh, sub 2 hours 45 minutes because that is the time that a friend of mine got. I want to beat that friend to rub it in his stupid face. Um, but as a first goal, sub three hours, I'd be really happy with that. Oh, come on, damn it. Did I? I did get it, okay. Thought I might have missed one of those chests. Let's see, what would be the best way to do this level? I guess first I'll come up here and get this one guy. Oh, and those gems. And then I'll come down and get this guy. this stuff, and then come back around to the other area. That sounds good. I imagine that in a lot of ways I am unintentionally copying the 120% world record, because I have watched that several times, just not enough to actually focus on what he's doing and where he's going. Ooh. Okay, that was close. Good, good. And now I'll glide over here. be the best way to do this. I don't mind missing that gem because I need to come back here anyway. Okay, so I'm thinking like I'll go here and get this stuff. here, right, right. Mm -hmm. 
Um, and it's occurring to me now I should not have skipped that blue gem. Oh well. That, no. There you go. Good dragon. Good purple lizard. Is this everything now? Maybe. No. No, it's not. Where did I miss one? Oh, it's right there. Oh, thank God. Okay. <laughs> that would have sucked if I <laughs> missed one gem somewhere. Okay, I got those guys. Thank you, dying guy hitboxes, for being in my way. That, I think, would be good for all of that stuff. Okay. No gems there, just a life. Life that I do not need. Oh, come on, Spiral. Oh, damn it. That's not how to do that. Wow. Come on, Toaster better than this. There we go, that's how to do it. Much better. I did get that, yes. Did I get the gems here? Yes. Good. Man, this 120% run takes a lot more focus than the any percent. And I did not think about that when I started it. Because the thing is, in the any percent, you can, uh, you can just kind of actually ignore a lot of the gems and whether or not you're getting them. Because even if you miss some gems, there'll be other gems later on you can collect instead. But with this, when you're thinking about all the gems that you need to get, much harder. When I first started speedrunning this game, I was thinking the any percent run would be more interesting because, uh, just because the routing would be more interesting. But no, 120% is also very good. You wonder if they'll introduce Hover back into Spiral 1? I was thinking about that. I forget who it was was talking about this, but somebody pointed out that it would be cool if they did, but a lot of the jumps in this game were designed without the hover, and we just wonder how much, you know, like, would it ruin some of the platforming parts of this game if you had that. And I'm not saying it necessarily would, I just, you know, wonder. How would the game play if it had that? Would it be too easy?
Okay, well, I really hope they keep the double jump. That would be fantastic. It's so, so broken. And it is... I mean, I like Spyro 2 and 3, but having the double jump in it is one of my favorite things about those games, honestly. It makes those speedruns so funny. Just these few gems here? Yes, it is. Excellent. for Shemp. I wonder what Spyro 1 would play like if they had the double jump in that. It would become quite a different game. Sparks of range for two and three. Yeah, they did by a lot. And I don't want to spoil too much, but in three, Sparks can get upgrades um, that make him suck even less. So that's that's pretty fun. Uh, yeah, it's that way. Sparks. The gem was right there. I love Sparks' new look. It looks so dumb. that I wanted to do. Oh my god. Is that everything? Yes. Hey, hey. Definitely kill me now meme. Yeah. <clears throat> I mean, you know, everybody keeps wondering, like, what are they gonna remove in Reignited? What are they gonna keep? What are they gonna do well? What are they gonna do wrong? I think the most important thing is is Spyro 2 Remaster going to produce as many memes as the original Spyro 2? Will they come up with anything new that it a that is as good as Trouble with the Trolley, eh? Uh, I don't want to do that yet. I want to do Night Flight first. 
I wonder if I have to get the key again when I come back. I don't think I've ever thought about that before. Hopefully the bird looks at the screen and winks when he says it, yeah. trolley game I remember feeling like it was impossible when I was doing it as a kid and I went back to it as an adult and it's it's not that hard at all. I got it like third try or something last time I played through it casually. find out if I need to get the key again. I probably do. What is going on? Whatever. Graphic glitches. I do need it. I should grab the other few gems I left here, and then go to Ice Cavern, and then I'm good on Beastmakers. I don't think I have too many gems left, I just didn't get these. And the ones around the balloonist, but I can get those when I'm leaving. Oh, Peacekeeper. I have no idea what I said. Whenever I'm streaming, I don't listen to myself. I don't know what I'm saying. <laughs> Did I call it, like, Beast Weavers or something? Dream Crafters? Ah, I called it Beast Makers. Okay. I wish the dragons didn't take up so much time to talk, because I actually really like a lot of them. Like that dragon there that I just rescued, who's like, Spyro, you shouldn't charge big enemies until you're big and strong. Like me. <laughs> and he's hilarious, and I love him, because I love all the dragons in this game, they're great. Go get the key right now. Oh no, I did it wrong. Oh well. <laughs> I was supposed to rescue that dragon and then get the key and death warp back, but that's fine. I can just do it this way. Oh, what? Green gem, please. Turning, please. even forgetting that death warp. I feel like this icy cavern is going pretty well, too. 
Ooh. That was close, though. I guess I'll find out when I finish the level. Oh, didn't see that green gem there. And I did see that snowball, and I just chose to let it hit me. That wasn't a mistake at all. Nope. I'm guessing it'd be faster to go up here and come back down to get the ones next to the portal. Ooh, I nearly just walked off that cliff. Thank you, guy, for just walking in front of me. That was very nice of you. Well, now we have a problem. I don't know where the nearest bats are. Also, the bats are some of the hardest fodder in this game to get. See some bats up there. Well, I wanted to do a Sparksless 120% sometime. Now I'm getting a taste of it. Oh my god, Spyro, just jump. Stop turning around. Bats? Bats, please. Thank you. Thank you, bats. Ooh. Not what I wanted. God damn it. one gem in here, please? Oh, please. Shit. Where did I miss a single red gem? I doubt I'm forgetting one. I must have just, like, passed it by. Hmm. Okay, well, I'll just give the area... Another once over. Not there. Not over here. It's not there. Okay. Got the ones over there. Yeah. Did I grab the gems right at the start of the level? like, behind the entrance. I thought I did. Oh, there it is. Lesson learned. There is a gem right at the bottom of that step. Locked away in my memory. I will get that in the future. Gosnold. 
I am ready. Thank you. Forty-four minutes in. This doesn't feel too bad. Like, what is that? Twenty-six minutes on Peacekeepers? So fun thing with the windmill chests, if you guys did not know. When you break the windmill chests, uh, the windmill part of it can shoot out and hit a guy. Like that. And like with the cannon, it kind of auto-aims a little bit for you. All of my any percent runs. I have just ran right between those two guys without hitting either of them, and I don't know why. For some reason, they they just keep ducking past me. Love seeing these guys fight. I wish I could watch it forever. But alas, this is a speed run. sheep that's over here. Probably don't need it, but might as well. That is everything there, good. death noise is hilarious. Yeah. I love, I love the noises of like everything in Magic Crafters. I love the noises the terraforming wizards make when they start screaming, where they're like, oh! Yeah, this is a really good whole world of levels. I absolutely do not need all of these extra lives, but I'm just being careful. Isn't the chanting the same chant that the guys in... I don't know, it might be. Great work! Uh, Colossus... 
Yeah, it's the one where the guys chant going like, Why I I um, why I I um. By the way, that's the wall clip I've mentioned a few times. I don't know if you guys have seen that before. I missed one of those gems. There it is. Boop. Kalex has shown up. Hi, Kalex. I'll talk in a second. Ah, oh, perfect. Can you shout for the root? Oh, I don't think I need any help on a root. I mean, I've watched 120% runs of this for so long. I have a lot of the things down already. Outside of, you know, remembering what to do. Definitely do not have that down. Oh, you are doing a set route for the race? Well then, yeah, let me, let me know what's up with that. What would be the fastest way to do this level? I don't think it's this way, though why did I start here? Definitely throw a shout your way later on. Sparks, there was a thing there. Why did you not grab the thing? miss any right at the start here? No, I didn't. Okay. Cool, cool. By the way, with the windmill chest, this is the best use of it. Just get that thief that way. Oh, damn. I want to jump in there. Oh well. I guess next I can just go over this way. Oh, that's not how to... whatever. It doesn't matter. Charge. You know, I bet it would be faster, given how much I've messed up, I think it would be faster to get those now and have the fairies take me back to the top.
You know, I don't think it is the same chant as in Colossus. This one sounds like more of a why, why, why. The other one's like why, I, I, um, why, I, I, um. Oh, that's not good. Whatever, I got a dragon there, it's fine. I got a dragon there, and I have been grabbing a whole bunch of extra lives that I don't need, so should be good. Yeah, this is looking right. Get the gems here. Wait a minute. Is this right? Are there, like, a ton of gems in this room? I mean, I know I'm still missing the few that are in the next little... Yeah, okay, that was another 25 there. I thought that was only, like, another 5 in that chest. Okay, this should be the rest then. No, it's not. What did I miss? Missed some more. Oh boy. What did I forget? Got all the ones in here. Got all the ones here, I believe. Yeah. I'll check the thief path again, but I'm pretty sure I got all of these. Unless it turns out there are gems on the left, which there are not. I'll check this wall again, I suppose. Huh. Did I get all the ones from the beetles? Did I pick those up or did I just kill the beetles? No, I got those. Did I pick up the ones from the guys up here? Yeah. Got the ones up there. Man, I am just missing gems all over this run. Huh. Did I miss one over by the... Th oh, there it is. I could have sworn I got that one. Like, I seem to specifically remember grabbing that one gem, but... Ah. That's fine. Considering I'm pretty sure I went the wrong way immediately upon starting the level, those are pretty decent high caves. I also have no idea what the best way to do this level is, but I'm assuming... Oh, nope, grab that one. I am assuming this will be fine. But the... Nope, there's one more. Glad I looked. Nope, Spyro, turn the right way, please. Saved that. Very close, though. 
A little bit too close to just jumping off the edge of the world there. Green flames. Uh, yeah, I think I got everything here. Oh, cool. Just death abuse. Go back here and get that other platform. Oh, I forgot to grab that chest though. Oh well. It doesn't take too long to get that. I like how they kind of use those gems there to hint that there's the thief on that other platform if you didn't hear the laughing for whatever reason. So many cool details in this game. Yeah, I'm... I agree, Insomniac has been really great basically forever. I'm not crazy about most superhero games, but that new Spider-Man game, I have high hopes for it. Peak done. That's all three of the main levels here. So I'll grab the enemy and the chest that are right out here. I guess I'll get the key now and go get that other chest. And then do the hard flight. Oops. Fuck. That's fine, I'm pretty sure you can reach it from here. Did at least a video on the combat last night. There we go. That looks so good, I was hoping it was just kinda gonna be like the... Arkham... No, I should actually look at what I'm doing. Games where you just kind of feel like Spider-Man when it looks like they added a lot of depth to it. Oh. Okay, let's see if I can do this right. Oh, 
No, I can't. Fuck it, I'm gonna just try again. Oh, man. In my any percent runs, I've been doing this really well. Oh, there we go, that's it. That's all right, though. I'll take that. I can get those planes later. <clears throat> later, like right now. Well, there were a few false starts, but I'm pretty happy with that icy flight. I believe I did not get that guy yet. Oh my god, I hate those enemies. Everything in the world, great. So when I leave, I just need to go talk to the balloonist. I can't believe none of those guys hurt me. I usually take a whole bunch of damage here. Altair. This level is like your ex? In what way? Or do you just mean the name? Yeah, okay. Ow, oh, fuck. Hate this boss. Okay, I only took one hit. That was a very, very good blowhard. That might be better than any of my <laughs> blowhards in any percent attempts. To go the balloonist. Go ahead. Oh man. 24 minutes. Good magic crafters. Also, I like how Spyro jumps on the balloonist's head to get into the balloon. It's just one of those cute details that makes this game so good. Gem. Come on. Oh, can I do it? Yeah, awesome. Oh yeah, you get to see 
Fenbear, you get to see um, at least one of the jumps in treetops done better. The other one I still need to do the normal way, but one of them is super easy, the speed run way. I'm glad I remembered that guy was right at the start, because I actually forget he's there a lot of the time and just charge into him and take a damage. I imagine Beastmakers is gonna go pretty well for me, just because in my any percent attempts, I basically get a hundred percent here anyway since there's so many gems in these levels Dreamweavers is going to be the world that I might start having trouble with, since in any percent all I do is, um, the flight and Jacques, and just skip everything else. Alright, I think I got all the gems before this. Okay, let's go wall glide. Good. Oh, did I? Nope, that's fine. Okay. Did not see the gems that were over there. That is all good. Very nice. Man, have I even taken a hit here yet? This is a good terrace village for me. I mean, not in terms of speed, because I'm not really going that fast, but... Okay. Okay. I even heard that guy laugh when he hits you. Alright. I shouldn't have opened my big mouth. Now I'm taking a bunch of hits. it right, I should just have those lower down gems left. I think I can start by going down here, yeah. Perfect. Well, until I started talking about how well I was doing, that was a really good terrace village. I have a blue spark, so I'll go ahead and do the fancy damage abuse thing there. Two damage abuse for the price of one. Ooh, 
I almost did not get that. Those boards, those boards are an homage to Hog Ride, yeah. I believe it. Pretty good wild flight. Is that all of the gems down here? It is. So I think... I grabbed the dragon here. Yeah. So I just have that one gem and then I can pop on. I'm gonna take that life before Misty Bog. I'll take that as a good omen. I have good luck going into this level. I suppose I could take it as a bad omen that I'm going to need that life, but I will choose to be positive. Okay, that was a mistake. Positivity is overrated. Oh, yep, okay. Great. No, that's fine. I was reckless going in. It's ruined me. There should be another chicken coming up. Before, uh, before too long. Okay, no, that's fine. Because cause now I have gold sparks again, so it's great. Everything's great. No worries. Oh, I jumped. Oh boy. You know what? Just gonna die again, get gold sparks back, not gonna try to rush this. That was a mistake. I learned from my mistakes. It's all fine now. There we go, gold sparks here. Perfect. No mistakes yet. Just gonna snag that life for, you know, no reason. Oh, Misty Bog. You know what the real problem is? I've been going around thinking that Misty Bog isn't too hard anymore. Now the level is teaching me a lesson. I've been saying, no, no, Dark Passage or Twilight Harbor, that's the hardest level. But, no, it's this one.
Ah, fuck. Why did that... Okay. I was curious about why that frog didn't attack me, but then that other one did in its place. Alright. Slow and steady through here. Yeah, that was basically as good as I could have expected it to go. Well, that was the hardest part of the level. Everything after this is not too bad. So hopefully I just, you know, didn't like miss any gems or anything. That is where the real problem will come, will come from. Man, I am not doing so hot on those spring chests. Oh. And for some reason, these enemies are not attacking me when I think they will. That frog earlier, that plant just now. I don't know what's up with that. Thank you, boar. That was perfect. That one, not so much. What do you guys think? Am I... Am I crazier, or is Misty Bug not the hardest level? I feel like I'm just having bad luck on it. Or rather, I was just having bad luck on it. Because in general, I think that Dark Passage and Twilight Harbor give me more trouble, but... But Misty Bog is definitely not an easy one. Yeah, they they will destroy you if you're not prepared. Where? Oh, okay. Hey. Hey, hog. Go. Okay, on to treetops. guys with bananas. I also sometimes hate the guys who pick you, but guys with the bananas seem to get me more often. Is that? Oh. I thought there was another guy here. Skip that life? I don't think I need it. 
Look at me being all cocky. You'll stay for this level and then you'll go. That's fair. Okay, Den, here's the jump. That's it, that's all you have to do. You just charge down, press jump at the end, you'll usually make it. And I mean press jump, like, right at the end, like, as you're going off the ramp. Once I got the hang of it, I don't think I've missed it. It's really not that hard to pull off. I have this dragon checkpoint, so I think I'm going to go ahead and death abuse here. Got that guy, and that one, and fuck the banana guys. Oh my god. I might as well take that extra life. I'm about to death abuse. Do not care about the chicken. Did I get everything here I should check first? Yes, okay. Now we'll use this ramp to get that chest. What? Why, game? Oh my god. Okay. Okay, let's try that one more time. I got the super hard jump. Well, not the hard jump, but the, the cheating jump. Oops. That's not how to do that ramp. And then I messed up the one you're supposed to do. Come on now. Get it. There we go. Now death abuse again. Yeah, you got the thief. Yeah, that's another thing. If you, uh, if you get that thief before he starts moving, you will get him. It doesn't really help much, but you get him. Okay, and then I will probably do one more death abuse here. Okay, let's see if I can get this jump. Oh my god, did I do it? No, I didn't. Damn. That jump is hard to get, but it is definitely possible. That's all the gems here. So now I will go back and do this jump the right way. And that's everything. That's treetops. Oops. Forgot about the gems right here. Ooh. That's a nice shot of the moon of treetops. And yeah, I got everything there. Okay. Moving on. Musgrub! Muzzgrub, you noticed I was streaming. I was gonna tell you, but uh, Discord said you were not online. Oh, fuck. Muzzgrub, you distracted me. <laughs> oh, damn it. 
Yeah, I decided to do my first attempt at a 120% run today. As you can see, it's going pretty well. I've only had a few unintended deaths, so that's, you know, that's pretty good. I'm fine with that hit. Oh yeah, it's back. Thanks for watching. I appreciate it. And there you go, gold sparks. Gold sparks in a metal head. Yeah, I I am on track to beat your time. I don't know how Dreamweavers is gonna go because uh so here's the thing, I've done several any percent attempts now, and in those, I'm already doing almost all of Beast Makers. So Beast Makers and Magic Crafters and Dreamweavers are all going pretty well for me. Er, I'm sorry, not Dreamweavers, Peacekeepers. Peacekeepers, Magic Crafters, Beast Makers. All going well, but Dreamweavers, I barely do any of in any percent, so I don't know how that's gonna go when I get there. Um, I also haven't done Nasty's loot in a really long time because I usually just do 100% and I don't like that level. Um, but yeah, there's, there's a good chance I'm keep your time. We'll see. I was just hoping for like sub three hours. That was my goal right now. And then my next goal was, uh, to beat your time. If I can do both of those at once, all the better. That's why I hate those guys, too. Okay, I believe I got everything up there. Now, Metalhead is not exactly free for me, but I shouldn't do too bad, I don't think. Why is there a green gem down there? What's that doing there? God. I don't know how to aim this dragon. There we go. Oh, and I even got those gems to home in. Nice. Damn. This was a really good metal head for me. That's it! Huzzah! I already got everything in Beastmaker's home. So now 
I can just talk to Cray the Balloonist and get out of here. What is that, 27 minutes? Yeah, that's pretty good. Still less than 30 minutes per homeworld, I'm happy with that. Oh my god, camera, that's not the way I want you to face, and that's not where I wanted Spyro to go. Oh boy. Still, so few unintended deaths, overall. Good start to, to Dreamweavers. Oh my god, camera. Where are you going? Okay. I'm hoping that that is my bad playing getting out of my system so that the rest of the world goes okay. Okay, Haunted Towers. Hopefully that is not an omen for what is to come. That did not hit me, and fuck. Fuck. Shit. Oh my god. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Would have preferred to get that door there, but oh well. Oh, oh whatever. I'll have plenty of time. that right on the first try. Oh, there's a dragon here. I want that. Okay, now I just need to not mess up these jumps. I did not. Great. That, I got it. Okay. Really hope the remaster gets Clancy Brown back to do dragon voices. I think a lot of the voice cast is already, I don't know about announced, but there's an IMB page for the remaster. It's looking like Tom Kenny is coming back for Spyro for all three games, which I'm bummed out about. I like Carlos more, but... But it looks like they got a whole bunch of the voices back. I guess I might as well get this area now. Oof. Not fun.
think that was everything there. Oh, is it mostly rumors? Ah, oh, that's too bad. I did not get everything in there. I'm glad I looked. Well, I know some of the voices on that page are basically confirmed from those actors' like Twitter accounts talking about the the remaster. But yeah, I definitely don't know about all of them. Watching a big pile of gems home in on Spyro is a good feeling. If only I could get flame charging down. Then I would be like Speedmaster Pro at this. already bummed you out not getting him back. Is that all the gems? Yes. Cool. Yeah, well, I guess we'll just hope for the best. Now I get these gems here and just die. Because that is faster than using those whirlwinds. And now on to another hardest level in the game. enemies fairly well. Oh, not like that I can. Yeah, Crash and Spyro were some pretty great games. gems here that I don't want to forget, because those are very easy to forget. Oop. That's fair. I deserve that. Get everything here. Yes. Good. Oh, I didn't realize he was in those movies. I've never seen Highlander, but Shawshank Redemption is great. And, you know, Highlander is famous and I've heard it is good. Let's take 
take that extra life just to be safe. In case I do something stupid, like walk off a cliff. Oh, on. Stupid turtles. Oh, that's awesome. I remember that character. Yeah, it's fun when people that you mostly know from voice acting do some real part. That happened... I saw someone I like recently in a like movie or TV show or something. I'm trying to... I don't remember what it was. And by recently, I mean like eight months ago I noticed this. But yeah, that's... that's fun. spring chests? I don't know, maybe you guys can't hear. I thought I heard a spring chest. Go. Yeah, that is probably what he's the most famous for. I guess the best thing to do next would be Lofty Castle. And finish off the run, or finish off the world the way you do in any percent, going to Crystal Flight and then from there jump over to Jacques. not making bad time right now. Sub two hours would not be as unreasonable a goal as I was initially thinking. I should probably get my any percent time to sub one hour first before trying that, but you know, whatever. I 
Actually, no, it makes sense to go here next, because I'm going to get the key up here. Yeah, this is fine. What? Okay, then. Well, that's not what I was expecting to happen at all. I mean, it happens kind of a lot that I get, like, one of the norks and one of the fairies. But never both norks and just the last fairy. That's new. I love that dragon's voice, but I need to skip it. He's the one that talks about how supercharged ramps and lofty castle can be cool. See where they take you. Excited for the red spring chest. Did I get all the gems here? No, I didn't. Glad I checked. I'm not missing any gems, because this level can suck when you miss gems. Spyro. That guy's arrow definitely broke that chest. <laughs> song, much in the same way that I love every song in this game. <laughs> what? No. No bad turkeys. Turkey pig things. good lofty castle. I'll take it. There's definitely a lot of routing I could be doing better, but for a first attempt, I'm very happy with this. I'm sorry, real quick, I got the gems that were... yeah. Okay. Good, good, good. Como? 
Okay, I believe you can just jump from here to there. Yes. Good, good, good. Camera, there you go. Fuck, that's too far. That's right. I'm also gonna grab these gems right now, actually. Get those stair gems when I finish. Jock, but oh come on! There you go. Spyro, please with the corners, please. Where? There's the other one. Oh my God! Where did you go? There did you go? Oh, this is Icy Flight. For some reason, I keep thinking this one's Crystal Flight. I don't know why. Okay, so now I need to grab those two chests, jump over to the balloonist, and run into Jacques. That is all the gems here. Very good. So now Jacques is the last thing in Dreamweavers. Good. Now this is one of the levels. I haven't tried getting 100% here in a long time, so hopefully it doesn't go too bad, but we will see. No fool. Come on. Oh my god. No. Spyro. Spyro, why? No. There you go. Good enough. I'll take it. I will take that. Oh my god. Oh my god. key so I can just go this way now. It just sucks that I also have to backtrack this way. So a bunch of that stuff I guess I can just leave behind. Oh, these fools. Where are you going, buddy? There 
There you go. Try this guy again. No? There you go, that's it. Yeah, that guy is tough to get next to the cliff like that. Death, this isn't too bad, I don't think. Oh. There we go. I hate this game. Oh my god. Great. Fantastic. At least I got all the stuff here this time. Let's try that again. There you go, dragon. You know, I just realized Jack is the only boss with two dragons. All the other ones only have one, except Nasty, who has none. I'm surprised I never thought about that. I wonder what the deep thematic significance of that is. I'm sure Insomniac was thinking about all of that when they made this game. And not at all, just like, boy, this part's hard, we should put a dragon here. There you go. I don't know why I keep picking up lives, I'm doing really well, overall. Okay, so ideally, these will be the last of the gems. Right, three blues. Perfect. I mean, not perfect. I died a lot, but decent. Now, if I can just get to the balloonist in 20 seconds, I'll have a sub 30 Dreamweavers. <laughs> Go to it. Hello, Adam. You have to collect all gems, destroy all chests to get 120. Yes. You have to collect all of the gems, and every chest you see has gems in it. So you need to collect all the gems. You also need to free all of the dragons. And yeah, that's it. Just get the gems, get the dragons. There are also dragon eggs you need, but I already got all of those. They stop about halfway through the game. Yeah, 
Karma says get all dragon eggs like I forgot about it. I remembered in a minute. Oh yeah, you're excited for the remaster too? Yeah, I'm happy that's finally happening. I have loved this game for a very long time. Although I am not speedrunning it in excitement for the remaster, I'm speedrunning it because I've been meaning to start speedrunning this game for a long time. And like, I don't know, a day after I started running it, they announced the remaster, so... Worked out well, I'm getting more viewers than usual. current speed run time that you're aiming to beat? Well, uh, I have run any percent in this game, which just means get to Nasty Nork and then beat Nasty Nork. Uh, I've run that, like, five times now? No, not even, like, three times. And my personal best there is, like, an hour and five minutes, and this is my first time trying 120%. And my goal was sub three hours for this, and I am well on the way to that, so... I'm very close to the end of the game. So I don't really know what I'm gonna be aiming for next. Maybe sub two hours would be my goal? Sorry, did I get all those gems? No, I did not. Thought I might have missed one. Thanks. Thanks for the good luck. That's... Okay, sure. I didn't think that should have made it, but whatever. I have no idea if using that barrel is faster than using the key. That is the last jump. Uh, this is being played on a PlayStation 1 emulator on my PC.
Specifically, it's EPSXE 2.0.0. Yeah, if I had a working PS2, I would... Well, if I had a working PS2 and a capture card, I'd probably want to use that, but... I don't know, I like my emulator. It's not like I'm going for world record times right now. Maybe if I start getting a lot better, I would... Uh, invest in that. Yeah, the PS2 is specifically faster just because the uh, load times on it are much better. It reads from discs. I don't actually know the rate faster. I want to say like twice as fast as the PS1. The load times are cut dramatically on the PS2. Hello again, Cosmos. Okay, sure. Okay, sure. That's why this level is this level. I don't know why I got that butterfly. I don't need it. I'm about to death warp. What was that, Spyro? Bumped too many things. You're just a big old bumpy dragon, aren't you? That's too high. Oh well. Lesson learned. Do not jump at the end of that ramp. Oh, that's not where I meant to go. The bridge is down. get all the things? Yes, I did. Oh no, wait, I ran over that dragon pedestal again. Fuck. Oh well. I guess I'm not death warping back. Yeah. Uh, I... Muzz, you would know better than me, but the Crash Insane Trilogy is, uh, considered a different game as far as the speedrunning community goes, right, than the actual originals. I imagine the Reignited Trilogy is going to be a different game mostly just because they're probably not going to keep the double jump glitch that's in 2 and 3, which, uh, which makes those speedruns hilariously short. Or at least it does for two, I don't know. The three run as well. Well, I suppose I also know it'll be a different game, just because I've been hanging around the Spyro community a little bit more, and they... They clearly think it will be a different game, and they're the ones who are deciding. Okay. 
that all the gems? Yes, good. On to nasty. Man, I am making good time. Muzz, how is your time so bad? I expected it to be hard to beat. Clearly you need to play this game a million times. Devote your life to it. Oh, damn it. There we go. Yeah, that's true. I missed a gem. No, I didn't. Maybe I did. I'll check in a minute. I'll check after I get this guy. Fuck. That's not what I wanted to do. Oh well. I guess I'll just go through here and focus on the gems first. Yeah, I did totally miss one there. Shit. Different engine, different graphics, and even though it's based on the same, it'll play differently. Yeah. Well, I mean... I... To be clear, I do agree. They're gonna make it a different game. But, you know, there are different versions of the same game that end up running differently and have different glitches and stuff that are considered the same game as far as speedrunning communities go. You just need to look at Mario 64 to see that. The different releases of Mario 64, they have time to be differently, and some of them are run some way, some are run another. But they're all put on the same leaderboard. But again, I completely agree. They're going to make it a different game. Gems? I am. Very good. I should probably take this part a little bit carefully, because uh, if I died here, boy would that be embarrassing. I'll take it. Well, okay, Mario 64 DS is a different leaderboard, but like Mario 64 on the Wii Virtual Console versus Mario 64 on the Japanese version. So now there's order again in the Dragon Kingdom? Well, mostly. Oh, I can skip this cutscene, can I? Can I? What will you? I know I can't skip the credits, but no, I guess I can't. Whatever. All right, now we sit around for a few minutes. Chill. Well, we wait for the credits to end. Shoutouts to Stuart Copeland for the brilliant soundtrack. Well, yeah, it isn't a different game. It's a different version of the same game. It is a different place to buy an official copy of what somebody is calling, you know, Mario 64, or what the official pr publishers are calling Spyro the Dragon.
Yeah, I, I guess that's true. It's coming under a different title, therefore it is a different game. Shoutouts to Carlos Alzaraki for being the best Spyro voice. dragons and into this level that I don't remember very well. Let's see how this goes. Loot. Well, I don't know. I remember there's that one thief in the plane that's a huge pain to get, so we'll see. Denver, if you're still watching, here's the other great use of the windmill chest. I've also been doing a bunch of any percent, which, you know, is theoretically different, but does definitely make this go much faster. I should get this rocket first. Boop. sure there's a way you can cheese this plane by doing that, but... Oh my god, Spyro. Spyro, why? Here we go. Here's where the 20 minutes on this level starts. Come on now. Come on. Come on. You got this. You... No. No, you got this. Spyro? Spyro? No! <laughs> oh my god. Awful at this game. There we go. Okay. Oh, yeah. Being comfortable with the controls definitely does help a lot.
momento. Hopefully I didn't miss any of those other gems. That's all of them. Huzzah! And time. 2.26.44. Hey, hey, hey. Sub 2.30 even. Pyro the dragon. You've you know what? I can be happy with that for now. I'm gonna go back to 80% and not do this for a long time. Bit of treasure in the dragon kingdom. How do you feel? I feel fired up, Bob. And I'm happy for the dragon world, of course. I certainly wouldn't want to spend the rest of my dragon days butting heads with Nasty Nork and his weird minion. What's a minion? Uh, never mind. You know what they say. For every good battle, you need a good adversary. And I felt that Nasty, in spite of his misguided nature, was a worthy opponent. Uh-oh. Here we go again. Gotta love those cutscenes.